going to explore here one feature like I have just made for me and maybe it, it will be useful for you also. If you go here in the section resources on site bithost.in, here I have added one new section like GitHub top. So in this section you will get uh, top repos some repos from the github which uh, from where you can check out uh, the different things and uh, different uh, repos uh, which which you can use in your uh, next project so actually i was uh, surfing a lot of webs and uh, and to find a beautiful and organized solution to um, i was suffering from visiting different sites many times so what i did i just uh, written one api uh, let me show you yeah i written one api in node.js uh, to get it uh, you can see here like uh, uh, this is one for public uh, ap this is one for public api for the previous section you saw and this is uh, for the github top repo search this is uh, running a query i'm sending a query and uh, sending a user agent at node.js now coming back to my point uh, my program like I have written here a query string get away some da, uh, hyphen and concatenate the string uh, and search in name there is algorithm like search in name sort on order sort on stars and uh, order description so now I can have uh, the list of the version the better part is like I am not paying anything uh, for this API what I have written uh, yeah what I have written here I am not paying anything and it's running it's giving me uh, um, the result between the between my application and uh, uh, and the github the mediator is API so how actually it's working let me show you actually my app is not calling uh, the github uh, api directly it's like going to network and going to refresh the page so what i see here it's asking for one api call here yeah. scrap github scrap github is uh, is uh, the middleware between my app and Git, uh, github so scrap github this url is being called and this url is uh, yeah i am sending query as uh, this is some nothing i have sent just uh, it's returning me the data this uh, this um, api is hosted on uh, Heroku, uh, Heroku, which uh, uh, which is free uh, for the experiments and all, so I am using it. Um, like you can see here, I am using this. I can see the logs also. Mm. Yep, let me show you. Uh, Heroku. Logs minus tail. So, uh, what it will return me like uh, the log, whatever the request will be generated. So, it will return me the log. You can see here scrap GitHub and the host is this, host is this, and uh, it started from starting to up. The system is running. So, let me show you how I am getting the data. What what is returning me just i will refresh again or i will just switch uh, like to php i want a version php repo so 
um, here it will reflect the log i can see here see it's uh, asked for this and uh, yeah it returned uh, me data like within three microseconds so my results are here so i will go to the news section like suppose i switch to dev news and i can see here it will scrap a different yeah it scrap a different api a, a different method like get news and uh, here's the data so i do not need to write all things so what i written um, the logics to get the list in my front end i just uh, use two three lines of back end you can see only two three lines of back end is doing my job and yeah it's pretty cool it's showing pretty cool it's ranged in right way mm. going to free apis like it shows me the associated api here i have written the if it's having cross it's uh, true this what what's this api means this these all are public available apis uh, which which are free this is for news here i have uh, mentioned too many sections like nd malware you can get the free apis who whoever whatever the public api is available for cloud storage and file sharing uh, yeah it's loaded so these are the available apis which are free for cryptocurrency these are the public apis available and for environment yeah you can explore it and you can explore the dev news cyber news at your own place this this these news are uh, taken from uh, the top of the providers like and yeah you can see and the sources uh, it shows the sources and better it's give a organized place to see all the things at one place like if i want like dev news means maybe developer news like related to programming related to php only related to python only related to um, typescript yeah related to any i have uh, given the list i will increase this uh, list uh, frequently to get more about the news and all here one business section is there you can explore from the news of business top businesses like what's going inside world so now these two these two sections are added as new section one section earlier it was having a blog section which very uh, you can uh, take a look at my blogs uh, few i have written and few one of my colleague have written here uh, so you can have a look uh, on blogs and if you have any suggestions you can write me the comment comment section is also there just uh, click on login i will be asked for login and yeah, let me sign in yeah you will be yeah, just uh, you need to um, log in with google so there's no anything and it, it's just to reflect you know, to write down the comment you can write me the comment or your suggestion so that i can improve my writing and uh, i can give you the better content in future okay i hope you have enjoyed this video follow on facebook and subscribe channel on youtube thank you bye bye subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for latest updates